Hey, hey, it's Erasmus over here, coming back at you with another quick voiceover. So today I was just going to talk about some of the tr uh, training I've been doing and also just a little bit about training programs. So basically what's a training program, um, what's like in a track session usually, like throughout the year what you would do, some short and long sessions, these are just uh, ways that track, track split up and also what I've been doing recently, like my session and things like that. So getting right to it, so what's basically in a training program? So this is going to be things like uh, weightlifting drill, your uh, weight sessions, your track sessions, uh, plyometrics, everything of that nature. Basically, you want to set out a quick consistent routine so that uh, each week by week you know what you're going to be doing uh, during the session so you can improve steadily. Uh, with track it's a little bit different because what you do in the gym might not directly affect uh, how, how your performance goes in the track um, even what you do on the track you might not directly uh, affect the way you perform on a race day uh, so what is a usual like uh, training kind of split for a track track season so usually uh, most most people will go off season on season they're the two big splits and then say within the off season you might have a hypertrophy phase uh, a strength phase because at that time you're not um, you're not running as much, and you might have like uh, getting closer to the season. You might have like a kind of fitness, general fitness phase where you're just trying to build up fitness for the season. Uh, during season, uh, that comes up to uh, what, what would I say? Oh, how can I put it? Like just more track work, focusing on track work. Because if you're in the gym all the time, you're gonna be slowing down, but during the season you want to be doing more track work like with uh, a lot of track you can split it into short and long season this just means that uh, short and long which just means to uh, usually off season you do short sessions where you build up your speed and when you get closer to season you do longer sessions so longer runs say 150s 200s and that's what, what you usually see with sprinters and people that do 400 and things like that might be the reverse so they might do longer uh, runs in the off season and then come short come to the season they do shorter runs to build up the speed but it's a whole, whole nother field that you can get more detailed in it but I'm just giving you a brief overview of training programs and how like they work so getting to me and like what I've been doing uh, I've been trying to focus on just getting more ses sessions in so at least three to four a week that's probably I'll probably say the sweet spot if you go to five six a week that does get a little bit tiring and you you really want to um, you you actually really want to what's it called have enough rest time uh, in between sessions as well so three I would say is the minimum at least three most people would say four even I would probably say four that's just that I just don't have the time to get on the track or even get to the gym work other set schedules so I'm just trying to work around those and see how good I get um, so well basically this is just a review of some of the tra training i've been doing like mostly i've been in the gym i've been getting into the track more a lot lot more often uh you can see me me here doing some starts they're not very good starts but you know they're getting there I'm trying to lose some weight i might show you guys some diet tips and things like that how how i do it i'm sitting around 86 right now probably get down to 70 76 so about 10 kilos off and I think at that, st at that level, at that weight, I'm pretty decent. Yeah, it's pretty doable as well. But this is pretty much the end of the video. Hope you guys liked it. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!